Before doing my preform, let me talk a little bit about cams because that's going to be a factor of what we use. So these are cams. They're made out of brass and they're different shapes. You can see we've got a whole bunch of them. I have no idea how many uh, cams we've got, but teardrops, hearts, um, ovals, you know, shield shapes, things like that. A lot of different cams are available and we'll be using these cams as just some examples of how to uh, preform a piece and how to basically mark where you're going to be on the piece when you do the uh, setting up your uh, pieces that you're going to go in the shape of the machine. So I want to reference those, as I said earlier, those go on the left hand side here, uh, right there. If I'm doing a sphere, then I don't actually need a cam if I'm doing round objects and that's where this stop, you'll see there's a little screw here and I'll use this little screw and this little stop with a wrench um, and I can then screw this down and then set that nut to wherever I want my stop and once I've set up that uh, position now it's replicatable and that's what we're going to be doing as we roll through some of these different shapes is I'll set up and grind in to get to the perfect setting and then once I have that perfect setting then I can just show you how we can feed slabs through it. Um, and that's really the thing that makes the shaping machine really cool is the ability to set up a setup that's grinding the way you want it and then just pop slaps through it and make multiple pieces of the exact setting once you've got the machine configured the way you want. Um, so it's a pretty cool aspect. So the next step I'm going to do is I'm going to go get some rock and we're going to start cutting it down.